Hello my friends, this is Armenian King and I am playing another campaign today. It's a mod for Ro uh, Medieval 2 Total War. It's called Rules 2 Total War, created by Russian modders. It's really awesome mod, one of the best mods in Medieval 2. Uh, I mostly like this mod because there is Armenia here and Georgia. This uh, mod is mostly dedicated to Russian principalities such as Kevin, Rus, Novgorod, Rostov and Ekt. But I am not gonna play as a Russian principality, I am gonna play as Armenia. Let's make it very hard. It's all r in Russian here so most of you won't get anything but I will try to explain as much as possible okay let's start as Armenia let's keep this part it's Okay, we start in a position where Armenia used to be in other Total War games and we have three we have three settlements one of my, uh, my capital is Ani one of the greatest cities in Middle Ages uh, in this region the other city is one and the other city is Ganzasar okay let's take a look at our settlement all these girls speak so much let's build some fields to boost our economy oh this girl, how to turn off her? I don't know how to turn off this girl. Maybe I should check it up in the... Okay, I found it. Let's take a look at the diplomacy. I am not in war with anyone. Here are Bulgarians in war against Byzantine Empire. Byzantine Empire. Let's take a look at my neighbors, Georgians. Where are they? Yeah, Georgia is not in war oh, and not in aliens with anyone. Let's send a diplomat if we have one. We don't have a diplomat. And we can't hire a diplomat. We need some buildings for it. Let's see what buildings is required to hire some diplomat. This building requires. This building will make a trader or merchant available, but I don't need a merchant. I need a. I need a diplomat. Here it is, but I don't have enough money. Let's construct it later. Now uh, it's time to end the turn. Uh, we have find some girl for Prince Sambat. 
let's marry him to her we have a new mission they ask us to capture Tbilisi okay let's send some send some army there public order is okay here and here too this is how uh, this is not exactly how Armenians must look but still this is uh, closer than in Rome to in Rome to Armenians don't look like real Armenians my king's name is Gagik and let's take a look at the family tree Gagik, a real Armenian name his son is son and hair is Sambat and his other son's name is Ashod Bagratuni Bagratuni is a medieval Armenian dynasty and it's also Georgian dynasty it's Armenian Georgian dynasty very powerful dynasty which uh, struggled against Arabs and many other invaders okay okay let's save the game or I will forget Now we shall probably end the turn. This is not really important. Khazaria has declared war on Byzantine Empire and we have we don't have enough money let's add some tax rate okay and where is to be Lisi? Here it is. Yeah, Tbilisi is the capital of modern Georgia. I don't know why it's not in Georgia in this game. Mm, it's not in, in the control of Georgian fa faction. But anyway, let's capture it. Oh, I don't think I can capture it. It's a huge army in it. I'd rather wait a bit or yeah let's wait and the other son of Let's uh, marry the other son of our king, uh, Prince Ashot Bagratoni. Okay. And the uh, factions of Murom or Razian Principality and Ch Chernagor Principality has now our Alice. Oh, it's really hard for me to translate from Russian to English these names. Names of Prince Russian Principalities. Okay. This guy's name is written 
Auch in Sieg, that in Armenian that means archers. And this guy's name is Shertavor, it's how to translate. Mm, probably guys with lines or something like that. Okay. We don't need it. It's for public health. Let's wait until we have enough money to hire some diplomat and have some diplomatic relationships with Georgia. Let's end another turn. I'm expecting Byzantine Empire will attack me or it's Khwarezm Empire. It's Khwarezm's empire is something like medieval Persia, but it was already a Mus Muslim empire. It is not like the ancient Sassanid or Parthians or Achaemenid Persians. They are very different. Okay, let's end the turn. Yeah, Georgian diplomat. Let's see what he wants from us. They want to trade with us. Okay. Let's make a counter offer. Make an alliance and let's demand some money from our friends. Okay, let it be thousand and let's ask them for map information. Okay, let's not ask money or just a little bit. Okay, just a little bit. They are, they don't want to pay us. Okay, we don't need money. Let's trade and make an alliance. They don't really want to be our allies. Okay, let's just trade and demand some money. Hope this will work. Okay, they are oh, they are okay with it. But I'm disappointed. I thought they would like to be my allies. We are our cultures are so alike Georgian and Armenians are are uh, good friends for ages this merchant is from I don't know where is he from Really, I don't really know where the factions in this mode very well. It's from some Muslim faction. And what to do with this city of Tbilisi? These guys are just really weak spearmen, but I need them more than these archers in the siege battle. So I will hire some. Okay. 
How many turns are left? I have tw 12 turns to capture Tbilisi, so I mustn't hurry. I can make a strong army then attack. Okay. It's hard to be a Christ Christian faction in in Near East, so Armenians and Georgians had really difficult history. Muslims were were always attacking them, were always making pressure on them on us, not on them, because I am a part of Armenia, I am Armenian. Okay, let's send these guys to our King Gagik. New Aliens, Sloman Principality and Chernogovskoye Principality as maiden aliens or maybe let's make some construct some church orthodox church I'd rather build church next time and I can hire some units instead. Okay, let's end the turn. Some assassin, I don't know whose assassin it was, killed my King Kagik. This is a really horrible event. And uh, I, I could see that another assassin killed the Georgian diplomat, so I think it's not a Georgian assassin. It's probably Byzantine assassin. So I must brace myself and wait and be ready for Byzantine army. They are also they are Christians too, but they they don't really care about me being Christian faction. So now my king is Sambat and yeah Ashot has a new son his name is Samuel Bagratuni I like this mod I like it very much it's all of the names are Armenian names and are used in Armenian uh, in Armenia today my name is Georg and I think if I play very long this mod, this campaign, I will meet my name in this family tree. Okay, we have no we have no commander here. Let's send some bot there. Where is some bot? Sambat is here. I Let's ask. Okay, this one. I'm in Georgian territory. I don't wanna make them angry. I don't. I wanna 
be their friend so I must take out some bot take some butt out of here okay I'm so short uh, short in money and some tsunami in on here ah King Kagik was not assassinated he was killed by this the wrath of the nature Tel Aviv, Georgian name. What's called this city? It's shaky. Okay, let's end the turn. I'm wasting time. And Mutsheta, you have if you uh, watch my let's play Armenian campaign in Rome 2, you could have uh, noticed this city in Rome 2. It's just uh, just a little bit uh, higher from Armavir. No, uh, just a little bit in the north of Armavir. Okay, time to time to take this settlement under siege. This army is so much better than mine. I need more archers probably a diplomat and one archer unit and I can send these guys to Gagi uh, to some bot Kiev and rules and Smolensk Principality have made an alliance. In the turn, these rebels are gonna attack me outside of their city. So I will probably with retreat and make a new army and attack them again okay uh, it was not hard to predict this event you know what I will try yeah I will try I like hard battles I like to win battles like this and become a hero. Let's try. Especially with Armenia, I will do that. Siege of Tbilisi. Sounds epic. Okay, guys. Let's withdraw a little bit what kind of units are these oh damn I have forgotten two 
to t turn off camera restrict this is gonna pain in the ass are these guys horse archers yeah they are horse archers Let's turn on canterbury silk circle let's uh, can I turn it off yeah I can turn it off okay now the camera is not restricted where is my calf let's first kill their calf I will bring my gen oh and I have the same sound problem as I had in third age total war I don't know why I'm having this problem. I have it even in Rome Total War. These guys are dying. Let's help my general with some spearmen. Oh damn! No, this was a bad idea attacking, mm. fighting with these Tbilisi rebels. Yeah, it was a bad idea. Let's flee, 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 flee. I don't wanna my general die, my king. Somebody dies, so let's flee. <laughs> Okay, we are fleeing. This is useless. I will revenge. I always revenge, so these Georgian rebels are not gonna stay alive for a long time. Oh, damn, I just don't wanna lose my gen. I will have only. Just flee, dude. I've been Shit. Stupid move by me. Stupid. Mm. Stupid courage. A true general must know where, when the victory is possible and when it is not possible. I don't remember which commander it said but it, I really like that quote and these guys are looking better than the Armenians in Rome too seriously I can feel that they are Armenians but in Rome too I don't feel anything Armenian in that unit okay flee most important thing is that my gen is alive don't worry guys I will revenge don't worry Crushing defeat. Yeah, I re played really badly. It happens sometimes. I'm not the best. It's okay. We retreated to our Ellis lands. I will. Oh, I can see a heretic here. This guy is a heretic. He is gonna make some heresy. He will spread heresy in my lands. So I must. I must build some. Ch 
church hire some mm, how it's called I don't remember you remember how it's called some Christian Orthodox priest yeah and kill this guy okay let's send my guys and retrain them I can't retrain the elite units cause my settlements are not really good right now but I will let them let to retrain them later these guys are pretty strong and I can use them against the Tbilisi rebels so let's stop here guys and go it on later yeah you will not wait too much to see the continuing of this the next episode of this campaign so Thank you for watching and see you later.